Hey what's up YouTubers, it's Dansky and in this tutorial we're going to be learning how you can mask images in Adobe Illustrator. So masking images is effectively using a shape to hide or reveal certain parts of an image as required. So I've got my new document in Illustrator, you can go up to file, down to place, select your image and then import it into Illustrator. Once you've got that, like I've got mine here, you can select the ellipse tool or draw another shape if you like. Left click and hold shift to create a perfect circle. You can select any color you like, it really doesn't matter, we're only going to be using the anchor points in the path from the circle anyway. So once you have these two elements on your artboard, we're going to select them both. Make sure that we have the image behind and the shape on top. If you haven't, just select the shape go up to object, down to arrange, and then bring to front. And I will select both of these elements, and you can go up to object, down to clipping mask, and select make. And there we go, it's cropped our image inside the circle. Now if you want to adjust the crop on the image here, we can just double click this, and it will take us inside. And what we can do is we can move this around. So you see that the circle the frame the mask isn't actually moving, just the image and we can adjust the positioning of this so it's a nice crop and when we're happy we can go up here and we've got this little back arrow so you can see by double clicking it took us inside the layer and then inside the clipping group itself and we can just click this arrow until we're back out and if you need to edit it again you can just double click go back in and do the same thing again you can release the mask altogether just by selecting the image going up to object down to clipping mask and release. And although it doesn't give us a lovely yellow coloured circle back, it gives us the frame back that we used to clip it in the first place. And we can quite simply just add our colour if we need to. But there we go, that's how you create masks for images in Adobe Illustrator and how you can edit them as well. As always guys, leave any questions or comments below, like this video if you enjoyed it, take care and I'll see you next time.